Hello everyone, my name is Alejandra and welcome to my YouTube channel. On my channel, I like to talk about what I do um, for my profession as a certified surgical first assistant and I also like to talk about my life. Sorry, I have been MIA for a while. I could not find the time and I could not figure out what to talk about on here. I am so used to talking I am so used to creating content for Instagram and TikTok just because it's so much easier and convenient for me versus YouTube where the videos that um, I like to make are a little bit longer and just require a lot more um, planning to do that. Right now, I am on my fourth travel assignment in Illinois. It's November, no, it's December 2nd and I've been here since September. So I am finishing up a 13 week contract and um, my plan is to just um, be off for the month of December and hopefully start working again in January. So this contract has been the highest paying contract I have had. It has been pretty fun here. Um, the surgeons are nice, the staff is friendly, um, I like the job, well obviously, but like I like the work that's available to do here, if that makes sense. Like I like the specialties, I, I learned a lot, I got to scrub in into vascular cases, I got to scrub in for neural cases, specifically spine cases, so that has been pretty interesting and I hope um, because I now have that experience, I just hope that it will open up more doors for me in the future. So I finished my last travel assignment in July. And so I was off for about three to four weeks. When I left North Carolina, I did not have a job already waiting for me. So what I did, I went to Lulapalooza. I don't think that's how you pronounce it, whatever. Um, but I went to Lillapalooza with my sister in Chicago, so that was pretty fun. And then later on, and then a few weeks after that, I went back to Chicago again to see a Bad Bunny concert. So that was pretty fun. Um, and then, yeah, so the town that I'm in, it's pretty small. There is nothing to do here. When I mean nothing, nothing like there's a walmart there's an aldi and i don't know there's a university here but for a college town there's like not much to do i've been going to the gym a lot if you follow me on my other socials like instagram and tiktok i've been posting a lot more on there my workout videos and fitness and fitness inspiration so if that's something you think you may enjoy you can certainly follow me there my plan for the future is to be done here and then you know like i mentioned earlier be off for the month of december i am looking at contracts right now it's pretty competitive i would i don't know if, it, if that's even the right term because a lot of places are looking for surgical assistance with CVOR experience or cardiovascular experience, and I don't have that experience, unfortunately. Um, right now, I'm looking to go anywhere where they are paying the highest. Um, I've seen positions pretty much available all over, so I'm signed. I'm actually signed on with like several companies right now. Um, and then, yeah, you know, I just. If I see a job that I'm interested in, I'll click on it, or if my recruiter finds something, then they'll call me or text me or email me saying, hey, is, is this a good fit for me? And then we, you know, we just move on from there. Okay, let's see, what else can I tell you about my time here? Um, you know, I've enjoyed my time here. I've learned a lot. Um, it, like I said earlier, it was the high, this is the highest paying contract I have ever had. My housing, I think my housing is like the best um, that came out of this contract. So my recruiter actually has like um, an agreement with the landlord at the apartments I'm staying. So all the travelers get housing here that work at the hospital because the hospital, it's like 90% travelers. Um, they probably have like, like seven to 10 people who are actually staffed there and the rest of the staff is just travelers. So my housing, they put me in a three bedroom apartment. Um, 
my recruiter asked me if I wanted to pay for it on my own or if they want or if, or if I wanted the company to take care of it and I always take care of my own housing because I've always done that in the past and just because I want all that money you know just to go towards me and then I will just pay my rent every month just like I do with my rent back home so with this company um i'm actually an independent contractor so instead of me filing a w-2 like i would at a regular job i'm actually going to file a 1099 next year when it's time to file taxes my fiance has some experience with it um i'm kind of nervous because he explained to me what that all means and i'm like yes even though i'm making a lot of money each week um, I'm gonna have to pay back a higher amount next year, you know, so yeah Well, that's pretty much all I have for you guys I just wanted to give you a quick, a quick update as to what's going on with my life um, It's December finally. It's my birthday month and it's Christmas. Um, it's just a very good month I wrote I think December is just one of my favorite months out of all of the year um, and yeah Thank you so much for watching if you have instagram or tiktok um you can follow me on there i'm i am much more active on there than i am here so if you have any questions about being a certified surgical assistant or if you're in interested in traveling um you know you can use me as a resource which is you know and that's why i created this youtube channel just to talk more about the profession and to help others who are interested Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I will try to be more active on here. Um, it's just very hard for me to figure out stuff, you know, to talk about. Thank you so much for your support and I will see you next time.